CFAM 4 coming at you. It's me, BDC. Back by the creek. Let's see what we can see. Got a nice sunny day. A little overhead sun. Two o'clock in the afternoon. Not seeing much. I don't see much. I don't see anything, actually. be a fish right over there I can't oh I hear splashing that's a good sign A little, a little bit chilly it's about 45 47 degrees water looks a little lower today I am not seeing much not much of anything Not a single fish, not a sucker, not anything. Ain't that weird? Go from 20 in one day to <laughs> nothing. Yeah. I don't see anything. Nothing. Oh, here comes one. That's a big one, too. I don't know what it is, but it's big. You can see its tail out of the water. Man, I can't see shit. I can't see shit on the sun glare. There he is, right? Right behind that rock, right there. Whoop! The tree branch I was leaning on just broke. Okay guys, I'm gonna go out on a limb and I'm gonna say that that's a steelhead because it's got a silver side to it. I hope you can see it. I hope you can see it. He's coming. Oh yeah, that's definitely, definitely a steelhead or rainbow trout. Yeah, I can definitely see the silver on the sides. He's in front of that rock now, right there. There, now I got some shade on the on the uh, phone. I can see the picture. So, right in that area. 
I don't know where he went. He might just be sitting there. Yeah, I see his tail. I see his tail. Okay. You see his tail coming up? Right? There. We zoom back out in case he takes off. Might be able to see it. There he comes. Right behind that big rock. He sighs. <laughs> There he is. See him? He's big. He's having a hard time getting up. <clears throat> He's up against that other rock. I wish I could get closer. You see his tail. He's got a big tail. I can see his tail and I can see his mouth. Okay. Where's the log at? I'm kind of drifting off here. There we go. You see his tail. See his tail fins. Right there. There's something right there. I didn't even see that. Oh, that's a sucker. It's a little sucker. It's just splashing around. I want to see this. I think pretty sure this is a steelhead coming up. He's having a hard time getting up there. He's big. Well, not huge, but bigger. I'm standing on this wobbly ass rock again, guys. Okay. Ah, oh, I lost him. Where is he? Zooming back out. Oh, 
Okay, I think I see him. I think I can see him. Got a red winged blackbird out there singing us a song. Oh, I forgot my water thermometer. <clears throat> comes another one down there. I just saw a little splash coming up. That's how I find them. I get uh, uh, an idea of how the water's flowing. And if I see a splash that's out of, the nor out of normal, like a little white cap, if I see something like that, then I know it's something out of the normal. It's fish coming up, spraying up a little bit more water than the normal. I don't see that one now. I don't. If I might have lost it when I was filming that sucker. He might have went back downstream. Or he might be still in that same spot, just plastered up against that rock. Or behind it. If he, if he gets out of that area, I'll be able to see him really good, unless he comes over here in the deeper area. Over here. If he comes up through here, I won't be able to see him until he gets right here. <coughs> If it wasn't for the highway traffic, it'd be really peaceful listening to the water flow and the blackbird singing. Got a combination of robin, robin, cardinal, and a blackbird singing at us. Oh, and a, and a, oh, I said cardinal. A robin, a cardinal, and a blackbird, red winged blackbird singing at us. Oh, here comes one up the middle. He's in that pool. I don't know what it was. Couldn't really see. Couldn't see real well. Came right up the middle. Oh, okay. That one is still there. I just saw his back. I'm going to try and zoom in on it so you can... So you can... Oh, that's that little one. I'm not paying attention to him. All right, where am I? Okay, right. Man, I lost my glare. On, I mean, I lost my vision on the phone. Well, it's good news that he's still in there. He didn't get swept back. So there should be two of them in there now, in that that area. All right, if you follow the front of that log, right? There. His tail, see his tail? 
His tail just popped up. Nice silver, nice silvery tail. That's definitely a, a rainbow steelhead. Okay, so I did some research. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, I can see his back. I can see his back really good. Right there. Yeah. Okay, so a uh, steelhead is a rainbow trout. That better not be a sucker. I'm going to be mad. That's a big fish. It looks like. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's a different. No, that's a steelhead. That's got to be a steelhead. It's got a gray tail. So, anyways, a steelhead is a rainbow trout that makes its way all the way back to the ocean to uh, to feed constantly year round and then in the spring here it comes it's a sucker god bless America I can see it you can see it real good it's a big sucker but it's a sucker I'm trying to Trying to get you guys lined up so you can see it too. Here comes another one right in front of me. I didn't know. I was zoomed in on that one. I hear him splashing around. I don't know where he's coming from though. Oh, anyways. Okay, you can see the the big sucker. I gotta. Okay. Yeah, you can see it now. See his tail coming out. Out of the water. Fins coming up out of the water. It's got big front fins. It's a big, what uh, I think, female sucker. I think the drab colored ones are the females. So anyways, a rainbow trout, or a steelhead is a rainbow trout that makes its way all the way back to the ocean to feed year round. And then in the spring, right as the uh, ice and uh, snow starts melting away, then, uh, Oh, I lost it. Sorry. Yeah, it's right there. No, I didn't lose it. Um, they come into the streams to spawn. So they have a different growth rate than a rainbow trout. Well, they're rainbows, but they call them steelhead because they grow so big. Because they get a, uh, uh, they get to eat year round. So I. I don't know. That's what the internet said. Anyways, they make their way all the way back to the ocean. Yeah, there's two of them. There's two of them in there. I can see two of them now. That's, they're definitely both suckers. It's disappointing because that thing is big. Yeah. Okay, so those are both suckers. I try to zoom in on it close so you can see it better. And I was really hoping that that one was a steelhead. I haven't seen any steelhead for the last three days. I'm pretty sure this is a the beginning of their run. I saw that one male the other day. It had beautiful pink sides on it. 
is, is really really nice looking. We saw a couple of decent browns. Alright. That's another thing. So here comes one. Just shot up. Being that same group as those other suckers. Yeah, see them? They vibrate like that to show the female, hey, let go of those eggs. I'm ready. I'm ready to spray them. <clears throat> so anyways, the brown trout <clears throat> looks similar very similar to a rainbow or a steelhead but brown trout don't get pink on its sides during the spawn it just gets a darker color back and it has more spots than a steelhead a steelhead or a rainbow will be like a greenish real dark green at the top and silver on the side and then uh, the, uh, the brown trout will just stay silver with a whole bunch of black specks, spots on its back. That's how you can identify them. And then a, a creek rainbow trout is a little bit different. It stays like a brownish, brownish orange during spawn time. Or during the spawning season. And then it changed back to its normal brown with different colored specks on it. So there's creek fish, there's river fish, and there's lake fish. <laughs> and they all they all do different things. Oh, they're still in there. There's three of them in there now. You can see their tails wagging back and forth. Swaying back and forth. If you look between... <clears throat> see that small rock sticking up out of the water, right? La, 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 la. Where's my finger? There you go. Right there. The fish are right here. There's one, and there's one. I'm gonna zoom out, because I keep dropping the phone down. If something, something else starts coming up, I'll let you know. But that was disappointing. I was really hoping that that was a, was a steelhead. I'll get closer to the water so you can hear the water. Oh, here comes one up the middle. Anyways, I'll get closer to the water so you can hear the water flowing a little bit better. Coming up on 25 minutes. I'll let it go just a few more minutes and see. See if I can see that one that came up the middle. Yesterday in the video we had 20 suckers in the in this stream. And uh right over in there. They were just swimming around, lollygagging. I don't see any over there now, but uh, 
Yesterday they were sure in there. Now, let's take a walk over the other side, or not the other side, but the other area. See what's going on over there before we hang it up. Ooh, ah. yeah. Sorry about all the sound effects, guys, but uh, I am 50. <laughs> And uh, my back and uh, knee isn't what it used to be. I don't see anything. Don't see anything down here right now. Oh, there's one. I do see one. It's a sucker. Small sucker. There's a, a bed, or what they call a red, right over in here where one was laying the other day. You can see that on, uh, I think it's part one from 4-3, uh, 4-3 part one. You're going to see the steelhead on her on a bed or a red they call them reds okay this is the end of the road but anyways right there right there is the the bed where that one was laying just sitting there trying to get a area cleared out to deposit its eggs it's not there today moved on moved on upstream yeah so getting back to our little flood story <clears throat> you see that pipe see that pipe right oh where's my finger right there that tree was in water right there water was up to top of that top side of that tree the tree was probably submerged in about a foot of water that's how high the water got the bank don't look it but it's about seven or eight feet high So that was a good six foot of water flowing through there. And in these deeper pockets, they, uh, the, the water was probably 10 and 12 feet deep. And like I said, this whole area right here, all the way up to this bank was solid flowing water. <clears throat> can look back on some of my other videos I got pictures of it. it says our creek floods if you go to the playlist of our creek that's where you'll find all the videos from our creek all our creek videos from the time I started filming down here to now that's where you'll find all of them even last year even last year still had run Everything. Alright, well, <clears throat> I think that's it. We're going to let the, let the creek be for the rest of the day today. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. You know, we this is YouTube, so if you want to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button and if you want to get a notification for the next time we have a video out uh, hit that bell and that'll notify you every time we post a video yeah, we do racing videos car shows that's our main thing 
but right now it's off season and you know with the virus thing going around everybody's shut down nobody's allowed to have a drag strip open nobody's allowed to have a car show nobody's allowed to have anything that makes uh 10 people or more together so and it it's unfortunate but we got to do what we got to do to stay healthy uh, in one of my other videos i said that we had five cases at work where I work and uh, haven't heard any more uh, any more statistics numbers being uh, talked about since then but you know I have a feeling <laughs> that they wouldn't tell us <laughs> if they did so I did notice that Friday a lot of people took off work Friday and I'm hoping it's just because the weekend but uh, there was a lot of people gone, a lot. The place I work at <clears throat> probably got a thousand people or more. But you can definitely tell when when people are gone. It was pretty thin. The parking lot was pretty thin, and uh, the traffic was really light. I'm just hoping it's because of the weekend and not because they're sick. Alrighty, that's uh, 31 minutes, 40 seconds. It's going to be a three hour upload. <laughs> so, uh, CFAM 4, out.